Most people in life are looking for how do I make a life worth living in retirement with having. The first step is to always live right. Literally produce a life for yourself that is service oriented for giving your life, your skills, your professional talents, and your abilities to other people. That's actually how we make a living, whether we're working internally within an organization or we're working externally selling to other people in other organizations. It is our job to put our best foot forward. In order to do that, we have to know how to give customer service correctly. If we don't know how to do customer service, then we're probably pretty mouthy, we're probably pretty bitter, and we're probably not doing things well at all on Twitter. You see, most executives run their own Twitter accounts on Twitter because they are legally liable for everything that is said about them, not at all. They're legally liable for everything that they say. When illegal people cyber hack an account, attack a person's life, or interfere with their abilities to have a clear identity, people do ugly things. I'm literally sitting on the side of the street and someone has placed down something so foul near my baggage I'm wondering why they did it at all. It was clearly an Arab woman because she played back around. And here's the thing about liars. They always want to go back and check. Did they say it? Did he know it? Does he know it was me? Can I see if it's still there? Did he pick it up? Did someone pick it up? I don't know. And it's sort of ridiculous little 12-year-old play. And a 12-year-old girl does shit like that today. A mature woman in the God's house of all creation knows what to do and what to say. And if you don't, I try to encourage a young woman who is putting herself together for a TV intro introduction for her class probably because she was running her own cameras I said you need to pause you need to relax and you need to listen to the Holy Ghost in your head because the Holy Ghost will prompt you with what you need to say appropriately but you're trying to memorize it you're trying to force it and that's why you're getting all tongue-tied you have to doing it over and over and over again today you see when you don't know what to say you can ask the loving Lord above all to ask his angels to assist you in what to say when you're ugly, when you're too fast in response, you literally tip your hand and how stupid you look to most intelligent people. You see, intelligent people knows what is what and who is who. They know what the laws are of America. They know how to work their real lives within the laws that we live within. The laws that we live within are literally international treaties with over 400 nations. We know the tenets of those treaties are human rights. Human rights are the foundation fundamental foundation of American nation. And what I mean by that is that we have fought our entire lifetime for our rights. We went through many changes, many lineages, many heritages, many colors, many races, many nations to become the smorgasbord of life.